Carla for Queens TV, Kingston Live, and we're investigating why records will make a comeback and what makes them so special compared to CDs and downloading music. The Kingston Record Show, which took place on October 4th, was the perfect place to find out why records were making a big comeback. The event, which was hosted by CFRC and Zap Records, had a great turnout. Why do you think records are making a comeback? Uh, well, I mean, one of the benefits of them is that they uh, are like a value-added product. People, CDs kind of look small and cheap, but a, a nice vinyl record, it looks nice. Um, and it's, uh, it's, it's nice to have a, a, that's something, that, that souvenir for somebody, especially if you see a live show or go to see a band, to take home with you. Why do you think records are making a comeback? Well, actually, I'm not sure they ever left, and at least in the minds of some of us. They're, uh, they're warm and they're nostalgic. Um, th so some of us would think that the sound is better than that of a CD or a digital form. That may be so, uh, that's very personal. Some of us just like holding something big and looking at the cover and saying, you know, it's something to hold and you can see the picture and stuff. And some of it, us just tie the music back to a certain time in life. It was obvious that the legacy of records still lives on today. So we decided to broaden our question to find out why records were so different from CDs and digital music. Uh, I think it's a way of forcing us to sit and listen in a very active way. Um, when you put on your, your iTunes, it'll just keep playing the set list forever, basically. Um, but a vinyl record, even more than a CD, you have to flip it around, you have to be monitor the needle. So you're interactive in a very tech, tactile sense, and in a world where that's not something we do very often with our, our pop culture, with our music or our books, which are all going digital, it's a great way to, to touch and feel. It's certainly uh, nice to put it in a room and hear the crackle of the vinyl. And our listeners at CFRC like that, when they can hear the vinyl record kind of snapping on air and, and stuff like that. When CDs came out, everybody thought vinyl was going to die, but it really only died for about 10 years. Other than that, it came right back, and nowadays they're making lots of vinyl, and, and another reason that vinyl is really strong is because a lot of the younger kids are buying it. You know, the, up in Waterloo, where we have our booth, there's uh, tons of kids, like, I call them kids, they're, they're like 18, 20 years old, and they're buying lots and lots of vinyl. And I think because maybe they listen to their parents' classic rock stations, and they're a bit fascinated, some people like vinyl because they figure it's it's a warmer sound than CDs. CDs are almost too polished and they just sound too smooth and so people like the, the sound of the old vinyl. This has been Carla for Queen's TV Kingston Live and if you're interested in buying a record, check out Zap Records on Princess Street.